the National Portrait Gallery recently revealed a rare painting of President Lincoln. The painting, which was hanging in a small New Jersey town, has been restored and is now part of the America's President's Gallery. Lincoln sat for the artist in 1864 and the painting was completed shortly after his assassination in 1865. The artist then sold the painting to an American diplomat living in Germany. The painting was displayed at an exposition in Philadelphia in 1876. It hung in the U.S. Capitol while Congress considered purchasing it, but it was ultimately sold to the Rockefeller family. In the 1930s, the daughter of a Rockefeller family member built a memorial building in memory of her son and filled it with art, including the Lincoln portrait. In 2017, an archivist discovered that a marble bust in the building had been sculpted by Auguste Rodin, prompting the foundation to reassess all of the art in its collection. The loan of the Lincoln portrait to the National Portrait Gallery is part of that reassessment. The painting is filled with symbols noting the president's place in history. He stands in front of a bust of George Washington and a rendering of the painting Washington Crossing the Delaware by Emanuel Leutze. Lincoln's hand rests on a bound copy of the Constitution, next to a scroll bearing a draft of the 13th Amendment. Behind the scroll is a small statue of an African-American man rising as he pulls the chains from his body, 